Hi, this is Craig Phillips, also known as Craig the Water Guy. I am the CEO and founder of Quality Water Treatment since 1990. I want to dis we want to discuss uh, the TDS that was found in your water quality report and go over what TDS is and uh, how to remove it. So water is a good solvent and it picks up impurities easily. Uh, pure water is tasteless, colorless, and odorless. It's often called the universal solvent. Uh, dissolved solids, which refer to as any minerals, salts, metals, cations, and ions that are dissolved into your water. TDS and drinking water originate from natural sources such as sewage, urban runoff, industrial wastewater, chemicals used in the water treatment process, and whatever it picks up from the plumbing system that delivers the water to your home. But other sources may also include salts used for road de-icing, anti-skin materials, drinking water treatment chemicals, storm water runoff, agriculture runoff, and uh, point and non-point wastewater discharges. According to some resources, an elevated total dissolved solids, also known as TDS, concentration is not a health hazard. The TDS concentration is a secondary drinking water standard and therefore is regulated because it is more of an aesthetic rather than a health hazard. But wait a second. Many contain elevated levels of ions that are above the primary or secondary drinking water standards, such as elevated levels of nitrates, arsenic, aluminum, copper, lead, et cetera. So why do they say it's not a health hazard? And why are they say it's a secondary standard? So therefore, it is important to take the quality of your water into your own hands when it comes to you and your family's health. For more information about TDS and how to remove it, please visit us at qualitywatertreatment.com or contact us and one of our trained qualified agents can help you. Thank you very much and have a great day.